so the first card we got leo is family second card we got is options so there could be somebody that could be in a family relationship with someone um leo or this could just be saying somebody that you are you have kids with is getting ready to come back around so somebody's getting ready to come back around some of y'all either you have kids with this person or they got a family behind the scenes but even if this person do come back, Leo, to be a family with you, y'all may have options when this person come back, Leo. Some of y'all definitely have options, whether you got kids with this person or not. But I am seeing that somebody definitely has options by the time they come back around and reconcile. What else, Spirit? Clear intuitive messages for, you for Leo and they love interest. What's really going on? What's really happening? So we got the page of wands reversed. But... I don't know why, but I, I just feel like this is somebody that you cannot take serious, Leo, because the lack of communication that's going on when this person come back around. It's like they don't want to talk about whatever has happened between y'all with this page of wands reversed. Some of you guys, this person could be trying to be funny and like, like maybe they come back around, right? And they could just be give all the attention to the kids and not explain themselves about what has happened between y'all. I know y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. When you let somebody in the house that you used to deal with and because y'all had got into it and then they come back around and say, come on, let's talk, blah, blah, blah. Before they pop up, they're like, oh, let's talk about it. But then when they come back, they just go directly to the kids, like, you know, ignoring you. That's what I'm seeing. But, um, yeah, I just felt like some of y'all, when this person come in, maybe you already have somebody in the house. Some of y'all may have somebody else in the house. Maybe you're already dating somebody new or you could be in a relationship when this person come back. Even if y'all not coming together to actually, you know, compromise to be together. Maybe this is just be could be your kid's father that's coming in to see the kids or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Why you got somebody else like in the bed or on the couch or something. It could be something like that. I don't know. Wow, we got the, the Knight of Swords right here. So there is going to be some form of tension between your, your person that you're dealing with and the person you got kids with, Leo, when this person come back around. Somebody could be forming some form of an argument. King of Wands reverse. Wow. Because whoever this is that's in, on your side, Leo, that you are dealing with, they don't they don't got respect for the, for your person. They don't like your person. I feel like that's what it is. It's, I feel like there is going to be some tension between your baby dad or baby mom and the person that you're dealing with, which is the option, right? Because once again, I'm seeing some form of disrespect go on. Maybe they say something very disrespectful to your to to your ex, or maybe your your um your baby dad say something disrespectful to the lover that you're dealing with. But there is some form of an argument over there on that end, um, directed towards you know the other person. Wow. Okay. We're gonna dive a little bit deeper because that's getting too spicy. What else, spirit? Which cards? Okay. I'm gonna grab one of these. We got the five of swords so whatever little scuffle that takes place during this you know reconciliation i feel like it's getting ready to be cleared up you know whatever obstacles whatever challenges y'all had is getting ready to be cleared up leo yeah this is somebody that you don't mess with no more i really do feel like they come back like they come to your house and come see the kids or whatever but um and they see you with somebody else but I don't know why, but maybe this person has a smart mouth. Somebody has a smart mouth. I don't know why, but I'm getting that energy where it's either your baby dad or baby mom said something to your new boo when they came in the house or your new boo said something to your baby dad or your baby mom. But like I said, that situation gets squashed immediately. Something get addressed. But what else, spirit? Now, this probably definitely ain't going to resonate with everybody, but I am seeing that. So, just take what applies. We got the four of pentacles. Yeah, I really do feel like um, your person could be living with you. Your new person live with you. Four of pentacles. And your baby dad or your baby mom come see the kids or whatever. Or y'all supposed to have some form of a conversation in regards of the kids. But like I said, in a mix of that, it was a little argument and it, it got squashed. But yeah, somebody is um in a relationship with somebody. But it's crazy because even though, Leo, you in a relationship with somebody new or you could be dating somebody new that's in your house, right, or whatever, I feel like your ex still got feelings for you. And that's the only reason why 
there has been some form of a, um like a little altercation between your new boo and your um and your ex is because your person really do want their family back. They want their family back. Even though they try to focus more on the kids and not be directed towards you, Leo, I feel like deep down inside, your person still want to hold on to you. They want their family back because they do still have feelings for you. They not say that, King of Cups, but they choose not to, to say anything. Even though it may be the it may be there all in their face or whatever, I feel like your person just choosing to stay cool and keep their feelings to themselves from this whole situation. Wow, we got the King of Swords. Some of this person may fly out and tell you this. Ooh. Some of y'all could be a water sign or air sign that is the person you got kids with, Leo. Um, or it could be the new love interest that you're dealing with. But I am seeing that some some truth is being spoken in this situation. I don't know if it has something to do with their feelings or if it has something to do with something else. But we're probably going to have to clarify in a minute. What else, Spirit? Some of y'all, yeah, I am getting that energy. I don't know why, but... Some of y'all's person could be telling your person that they got feelings for you. I don't know. They could be telling you or they could be telling you. I don't know. So we're going to have to clarify. If not, I feel like there is. That's too many cards. Spirit, we only need one card. We don't need all of these cards. Let me shuffle it and then cut. Because we need the right card. If somebody ain't saying something. That's why these cars so stuck. Somebody keeping something to themselves. They, they don't want to say nothing. Three of Wands reverse. Yeah, that's the only reason why your person could be acting like this, Leo, is because, um, like I said, they, stick, they still got feelings for you, Leo. They really do. But some of those person could be telling you that they ain't doing too good. Or they could be ha having a hard time moving on or something. But... It's something that this person not telling you all the way. Or this could just be saying how they feel. But I'm not seeing too much communication. I just felt like your person may be keeping this to themselves. That they honestly not, you know, they're not doing too good in regards to their life, period, and instability. Some of y'all are going to end up telling this person they got to go. Some of y'all gonna tell this person they gotta go. That they, you don't wanna get back together with them. Even if they do flat out tell you, Leo, the truth about what they got going on or whatever, or if they t tell you that they love you, this energy is a little bit all over the place, but I am getting that energy where this is, this stands out to me the most. This person really wanna hold on to you. Even though you could be dealing with somebody else, Leo, this person does love you and they do want their family back. You know, yeah, they may not tell you that part, but the truth is they're not doing too good. They're not. They're not, they, they're not cool with the simple fact that you are dating somebody else, entertaining somebody else. And that's exactly what it's really saying. Like, because this person is deeply in love with you. Didn't I say this person wants to come back? They want to come back. Some of y'all could be Aquarius. They're struggling right now. We got the two of Pentacles. This person is struggling. The Hierophant reverse. Now, some of y'all relationships may be struggling too. Maybe y'all both have feelings for each other and y'all both not saying anything. But, or one person just not saying anything. But I am getting this energy that somebody do want another chance. Because they're struggling in a relationship. Or it could just be saying that somebody is struggling to co be committed. Maybe you do have feelings for this person also, Leo. But the real truth is that even if y'all was to get together, this person, you feel like this person would be out here cheating on you. You know what I'm saying? You just feel like this person is not able to give you the commitment that you are looking for in a relationship. But I'm just reading different energies because I'm seeing different energies. Some of y'all got a new boo. The rest of y'all, it could just be you, but you do talk to somebody else. Maybe the new boo not living with you. Maybe that could have just been y'all energy arguing with your baby dad or your baby mom. Maybe the new boo was never really around, but that was just some of the energy that I was seeing. It could just be you and your baby dad arguing, you know what I'm saying? And it led up to this. But like I said, I really do feel like feelings are, is there, but somebody is like choosing to hold back these feelings, you know, and they struggling, you know, 
with those feelings and they're struggling in life without you as a family, Leo. But at the same time, it's saying that they also struggle with commitment. And that's probably why you haven't took this person back yet. Yeah, justice reversed. Some of y'all, this is somebody that you have divorced. So, of course, not everybody. So not only you feel like this person struggles with commitment when y'all was together, but you also feel like this person don't treat you right. Period. Some of y'all could be feeling like if you take this person back, it would be just that. They will be cheating on you again, you know, acting like they're single. And um, they just don't treat you right, period. Yeah, I feel like a lot of you guys are moving past this energy and walking away with peace. Because you're happy, yeah. Because you're walking away. Then I say some of y'all could be in a new relationship. Because you're in another relationship with somebody else. Or you could just be feeling like you're doing better without them with just you and your kids. If it's just you. So y'all take with applause. Because some of y'all, when this person popped back up at the beginning... Y'all could have somebody like laying on the couch or y'all new boo somewhere standing around in your house when your ex pop up to see the kids. You know what I'm saying? And it may be some form of an altercation. But like I said, that get cleared up real quick. The rest of y'all, it could just be you and your kids and the baby dad pop up to see the kids. But y'all could get into some form of altercation or whatever. But like I said, with or without the other person involved, you know what I'm saying? This may have took place in some way, shape, or form. But... I am seeing that the only reason why your person is going there and pretending that they want to see the kids in reality, they're trying to check up on you and be nosy and see who you're dealing with because deep down inside, this person still loves you, Leo. But like I said, it's giving me all the reasons why you could be re rejecting this person and don't want them because they don't know how to commit when you do have them. But um, let me pull some more cards for y'all. Look, they can't let you go. Secretly, they can't let you go. I knew it. Some of y'all probably dealing with a Scorpio, a Leo, a Taurus, a um, Libra, or Air sign. Aquarius. What else, Spirit? Clear intuitive messages, please. You're right. So some of you guys, the person could be telling you you're right. Maybe they trying to say something. Y'all arguing or talking about something. And if we telling you you're right, you're right. You know what I'm saying? We got liability. So some of you guys, the new person could be a liability. Or the old person could be a liability. I don't know. But y'all just take what applies. Maybe you feel that way. But it is showing me that somebody is struggling, though, in a, you know, without you, you know. Yeah, this person is very deceptive, very, very deceptive. Um, we got workplace. Um, some of you guys, maybe you met this person at work, whether this is the old person or the new person. But um, some of y'all's person secretly lost their job, and you may not know that. And that's probably why we got the three of wands right here reversed. They haven't been doing too good without you and the family. It's because... They either could be, don't have nowhere to go or they don't have no job. And that could be another factor that they don't have no job. And that you you could be another reason why they want to come back. I mean, the work situation could be another reason why they want to come back. Because they don't have nobody to depend on. They don't have a job and stuff. But that's just um, simple messages for some of you guys. It don't have to resonate all you guys. But just take what applies, Leo, and y'all take care.